Hello, welcome to Gordon's Diaries. Um, and here we are, here I am, in Spain, in our attic, um, which is going to be our studio in the future. And today I've been working um, here, working on Skype classes, offering Skype classes to um, our students. Now, I want to talk about something that is quite important for anybody who works with internet, uh, the internet, I should say, and that is the connection. Now, in the UK, our internet connection is superb. Why? Because we have fiber optic and um, we have chosen in the UK the, the largest capacity for fiber optic. So what that does, that gives us 75 megabytes per second of download and 15 to 17 megabytes per second of upload. So for anybody who understands that, that's a lot. So we never have problems when we're uploading videos to YouTube, it takes 10 minutes to upload a video. Now, I suppose in many ways we've, we have been spoiled because now we're in Guadalajara, we are in the middle of um, an estate, a private um, villa estate, and um, the connection is not good. In fact, when we paid for our broadband here, uh, we were told that we would, we would be given 10 megabytes per second. Now, that's okay. 10 megabytes per second is okay. But we work on Skype every day, just about every day giving classes. So our quality needs to be really good. Skype only needs 500 um, kilobytes or half a megabyte of download ability, but it also needs half a megabyte or 500 kilobytes of upload capacity. And this is where our problem began because I've been checking the internet, uh, our connection, and before we were having maybe six, five megabytes of download and upload only 0 0.3, 0 0.4. What did that mean? That meant that when we were talking on Skype, the connection was rubbish. And I was starting to panic because um, it's our business and we're moving here in July. So I was really panicking. So I looked at the options. I was thinking about satellite uh, internet because you can get 22 uh, megabytes of download from satellite and seven megabytes of upload, which is not bad. The problem is that with satellite um, internet, I've heard and I've seen on the forums that maybe there's a time delay when you are talking, which is not good. In a Spanish class, it's okay if you're talking to, or an English class, it's okay if you're talking to your family, but in a, in a classroom situation, it needs to be good. So today we have called the internet provider, Jaztel, and we have explained the situation. And like that, they have improved the situation. They have increased the upload speed to 0 0.6, 0 0.7 of a megabyte. And the download speed hasn't changed. If anything, it's better. So I'm confused, but I'm not really. I know what happens. What happens is internet providers um, buy a share of a service from Telefonica, and the same in the UK from British Telecom. 
Then what they do is, let's say they buy 25% of a service, a line. They then sell that to their customers, but they sell more. So they, they buy 25% and maybe they sell 30%. So they're selling what they haven't got, a service that they haven't got. So amongst their customers, somebody has a bad service, always because there isn't enough capacity to go around. So what you have to be, you have to have the biggest mouth and shout and say, I want a better service. And so they make the adjustments. So undoubtedly, because I have gotten a better service today, somebody has probably got a worse service. Okay, but <laughs> this is my business, so I'm happy. So all today, after they made the adjustment, I've had classes, Skype classes without problem. Fantastic, I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy. I'm interested to know anybody who has satellite internet, I'm interested for you to tell me if you use Skype and if you do, what kind of service does it give you? And is there a delay when you speak or is it not noticeable? These are interesting things for me. So if you can, pop your answers on the comments and I'll happily read them and reply to you. Okay, so see you later. Bye.